Joining us this evening on WHKY TV News is David Lerner, the District Attorney representing Burke, Caldwell, and Catawba Counties. Thank you so much for coming in again. Hi Rob, thank you for having me. It's good to see you and we talk every month about things that are going on in the District Attorney's Office for the Thanks three so counties much. and I know you wanted to lead with a situation in which an individual was cleared, correct? That is true. Uh, this happened this month. Uh, we had a situation where a gentleman 58 years of age was being tailgated over near Valdez. When he got into town where the road widened, he pulled over near the curb to allow this tailgater to go on past him. But instead, the other driver jumped out, ran up, and began to strike this man, punching him through the window of the car. And um, the 58-year-old gentleman fired one round and, and shot the man in the shoulder, which ended um, the assault. And we looked into it, we investigated, um, the Valdez Police Department uh, gave us their, their findings, witness interviews, eyewitnesses to this, and I cleared this individual. Um, he, he did use uh, potentially deadly force there, but he was justified in doing so, and you're not under a duty to retreat in that, in that circumstance. There's nowhere to retreat to. And it was in the middle of the day, so you did have some witnesses. Oh yeah, absolutely. Middle of the day, we had eyewitnesses, and um, you know, I just want people to know that you have the right to defend yourself. And as long as I'm your district attorney, I support that right, and I will protect that right. Uh, where the evidence bears out that an act was done in self-defense, then that's, that's the end of the story. You had a couple of cases you'd like to talk about? Oh, yes, we do. We've got a couple here. Um, let's see, Montavious Lamar Mayfield, 24 years of age, will be spending the next 8 to 11 years in prison. We gave him a jury trial in Catawba County. He was convicted of an armed robbery. Um, this, this trial took four days to take care of, but the jury only needed about a half an hour to make their decision. And uh, he had entered a convenience store on Old Lenore Road in Hickory wearing a hoodie and gloves, fired a round in the store, didn't strike anybody, but he, he fired the gun during this armed robbery. And then he, he, um, he, he had a, a mask and the gloves and dropped them behind the store. Officers recovered them and the firearm that was used. We had DNA analysis that tied this individual to the crime and he was convicted. So that's another uh, violent criminal off the streets to make our communities a safer and better place to live, work, worship, and play. That's my goal as your district attorney. Well, that's all we have time for, but thank you for the information. As always, we appreciate you coming in and updating us and we look forward to talking to you next month. Well, thank you, Rob. It's a pleasure. David Lerner with the latest from the District Attorney's Office. I'm Rob Eastwood and now back to you, Ralph.